All right, so this is kind of a short update of uh, where the car stands on Tuesday on a, you know, um, right before my trip on Friday. Uh, there's been some doubts on whether I could finish it, but I might be able to swing it together. Anyway, uh, figure I'd get some new shots while it's not running. I mean, it will fire, I just don't have gas in it right now. Uh, I figure I'd get some stuff uh, explained before I fired it because I'd, I'll never remember. Uh, anyway, you can see the uh, G6 coils fit in there nicely. I actually shortened all of them, and they're still too long. And then I got the uh, manifold heat wrap nice with a titanium wrap because it didn't want itchy. It's still itchy. That's uh, worth noting. I got the uh, trans lines right there. Hard lines passed away to get rip, and then they drop down, come around, and then up to the big Dodge trans cooler, which you can't see. You might be able to see it. Uh, obviously, there's a turbo intercooler, blah, 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 stuff you've already seen. All right, now here's something interesting. This is a 2010 L99 water pump. This is a C5 Corvette tensioner, and that's all truck accessories, and it all lines up. And if I remember correctly, uh, I'll put a item number in the uh, description, but that's like a 71 and a quarter inch belt. It's perfect. Um, oh yeah, I figure I'd show you the exhaust too. Focus, focus, not what you think. Uh, maybe from here. Oh yeah, that's going to melt my bumper nice. Sweet. And uh, to do cut around to here. No, I'll go on the other side. Uh, pass all this bullshit. Look in here. I got the ECM all nice and mounted. Uh, fuse block block for the uh, ECM and tucks away nice in there. Alright, let's uh, head on underneath. Show off the fuel system. Or the pipe bomb as everybody's been calling it. Anyway, here is the lift pump that pumps over to the surge tank, which looks like a more extreme angle than it actually is. And it comes to the 044 knockoff, which I heard is going to fail me. Corvette regulator, and blow up right back to the tank. Nice, huh? Look at all the hoses. And then runs all the way up, like so. No cable ties yet, so everything looks messy, which is nice. But um, yeah, I gotta make a trip this Friday, and uh, I'm still building the car. So we'll see how that goes. Oh yeah, I wanna show this off. I'm turn off this fan. Look at that, Sun Pro, luxury. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much the update for now. Uh, it's not, I mean, like I said, it could probably key on fire, but I don't have any fuel and I don't feel like fueling it up until I finish it. Because I want to just drive it with giant holes in the floor and I know everybody's going to be like, you burn out, but I don't have the rear end welded yet. So that's all about making it to the trip and not blowing it up beforehand. I'll blow it up after the trip, I promise you guys. Anyways, that's it. Till next time, see you guys.